All right, good morning guys. Actually, uh, I'm about 45 minutes late to starting this vlog, saying good morning and arriving at this school. We're visiting a summer program that's like a, it's like a drone camp. So these kids are spending spending their summer um, actually learning to build and fly drones, which is just really awesome that they're doing this. I'm here to uh, talk to them as kind of like a, a guest speaker and expert in FPV drones. All right, look at all this, look at all this sciencey stuff they've got. So a really cool program they have going on here and it, it comes in at multiple levels, right? So, so the youngest kids pretty much get to enjoy flying tiny whoops, right? So some of them, the micro brush setups and then the, the older groups, they're learning everything from soldering to beta flight configuration, uh, building the quad itself, of course, and then yeah, eventually getting to fly them. So it, it's hitting on all these levels of both education and fun. Yeah, they're all learning how to solder. I'm teaching them all how to run through beta flight. Yeah. Um, and problem solving, right? That's like the biggest thing. And then now you're talking about the next level that you want to do is yeah. kind of like a start to finish design class, right? Yeah, so actually I'm teaching a class next year. And the kids are going to do learn 3D CAD. Each kid will design their own frame, creating their own brand, creating their whole like own marketing mm -hmm. uh, logo. So you're work, working toward a program that's from you know start to finish, yeah. design to business, really. Yeah, yep. the drone touch is so, so many areas. Yeah, the drone is like uh, is the tease of like, oh, that seems cool, but there's so much learning inside of that right. that they don't see that's happening, which is, I think is the best way to learn. Absolutely. Really awesome thing they're doing here, and I, I'm I don't know, I really hope to see more education involving flying robots taking place at schools. Uh, I, I just feel like it's such a good catalyst for so many different topics. You have the mechanical building aspect of the drone and then you have to learn a lot about kind of RF and antennas and then there's even elements of programming in the configuration that you have to do in the software. Then of course recreationally the, the flying it's a really enjoyable hobby and then even from there the next step is you get to make art. If you record your videos you get to make art. So there's all these aspects of science and art all rolled into one that, that is, I think I've said before, that, that juxtaposition, that combination of science and engineering and creativity and art is why this is, this is definitely the best hobby. I mean, it doesn't, does it get any better than FPV drones? The answer is no. <laughs> Look at this right here. This is a new build I've been working on. I was really hoping to have it done for the, uh, for the school today, but Eh, didn't, didn't finish it in time. So a little bit of work left on this, just a couple quick solder points and then bolt the top plate on. But I'm really excited about this one because this is the first build that I've done using the production riot control board. This is our signature hype train electronics flight board. I worked on the development for this product with Rotor Riot for a long time. So seeing it finally in production is really exciting. I've been flying a bunch of the prototype boards in numerous drones for, for some time now, but this is the first production one, so want to get it all bolted up. All right, look at this, look at this. Here is how the flight controller actually began as, as a sketch that I cobbled together in PowerPoint of all things. So from here we made a bunch of different revisions and drawings and things like that, but it all started as just this, this crude drawing. 
So yeah, seeing uh, something that was once a sketch on my computer screen really come to life as a real product, uh, really exciting. I, you know, I used to work as an automotive engineer and now um, I do so many different things, uh, everything from marketing to event planning to screen performance in a, in a sense, uh, but I still get to use some of my engineering skills in, in our product development. So it's really fun to still get to apply that to something I'm really passionate about, like FPV drones. So um, yeah, I, I really do want to fly this day, so I'm going to stop chatting, get this fixed, and then we're going we're gonna to head out. A little rip, a little FPV action, a little... All right, we have made it downtown Detroit just in time for the most golden of hours. Uh, you know, I've mentioned in the past we've been losing some of our bando spots as they've been uh, knocking them down and rebuilding and all that good stuff. But, don't worry, there's always more. We're actually walking into a new spot. I haven't been here before. The Detroit guys first started coming to this spot. Oh God, don't get hit. Oh God, oh God, oh God. The Detroit squad found this spot while I was off traveling somewhere or other. So, I've seen them fly and I'm psyched to check it out myself. I think this is my new favorite spot. There's so much here. I feel like I've just scratched the surface, but solid, solid way to squeeze in the session. Solid place to squeeze in the shush. Squat, 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 squat. <laughs> I, <can't. laughs> I need to come back here and spend like a whole day flying. <laughs> Ashley and I are at Kaju Cafe, which isn't actually a cafe, it's a bar, go, and go, we are go, playing go, go, go. feather bowling, go, 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 go. which isn't actually go, bowling, go, go, go. It's, oh. it's hanging out in like this dirt oh, lane. Hold on. What? Oh. <laughs> the idea is there are these feathers at the end of the lane, and you have to get the thing close to it. All right. 
but she did win. But it was it was close. It's not like you kicked my butt. It was like one point off. One point away. Super close. I don't want to hear it. Thank you guys for hanging out. Thank you. Always appreciate it. Stay tuned for more adventures. See you soon. Quit gloating. Quit gloating. Quit gloating. <laughs>